A big milestone puts the spotlight on the future in Pine Bluff. Saracen Casino Resort took another step closer to opening today. And as TSV 11's David Lippman reports, it's already had a big impact on the city. Yeah, Craig, there was a topping out ceremony for the gaming floor and it highlighted some of the big numbers like 19 miles of electrical cables and 700 tons of steel in place. But leaders for the project and the city say the casino is building a new exciting vision for Pine Bluff. I think it's the peak of progress. Literally, this beam will be the peak of construction on Saracen Casino Resort's gaming floor. But casinos are all about fantasy. And Pine Bluff Mayor Shirley Washington is dreaming about the jackpot. We want Pine Bluff to become that destination city, and we think we're on the brink of making that happen. I know a lot of the workers that you see in the back, those are truly the people that you ought to thank for being where we are today. Based on what we've seen at the Annex, we expect incredible things to happen here in June. Washington says incredible things are already happening because of the tax revenue from the Saracen Annex and the way visitors spend money in the rest of the city. I would say that overall, with all the tax increases, it's been over $100,000 a month. With, with, that's including gaming and other tax coming in. The full gaming floor will be seven times as big as the annex, and that's before you get to the hotel, restaurants, etc. Washington said she's trying not to spend that windfall just yet, but will put the city's share of the winnings into parks and quality of life projects. We really have to hold back. We have to be very conservative. Uh, just seeing what has come with such a small fraction of what's coming, yes, uh, it's, 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 it's hopeful. It builds a lot of hope, a lot of promise for what's, what we can expect to happen in our community. The annex has validated what we knew. Our theory was that this was going to be a great opportunity, and I think it's proven true. The whole project is expected to cost $350 million by the time it's done. The gaming floor is on schedule to open in June, while the hotel, entertainment space, and the rest of the amenities will open next year.